And the last example, use the given area to find AB. So this is what we're looking for here. Area is given here, area is given here. This is also given, the corresponding side is given. So let's label this as A and this as B. So A to B is would be the scale factor between the two figures. We don't know A, but we know B. B is 8. So it's going to be A to 8. And A is what we're looking for because that's AB. Now, I know for the areas, it's going to be uh, the scale factor squared, right? So it's A squared to B squared, which is A squared to B is 8. So 8 squared. Now, that's the same thing as A squared over 8 squared, right? So we're going to use this ratio and make it equal to these areas. So A squared is the same thing as here, 218 over 166. So the ratio of this area to the area is A squared to 64. And you're just going to use this proportion to solve. It's going to be 166, and I'm just cross multiplying. A squared equals 218 times 8 squared is 64. Okay, so from here, you can just divide this 166. A squared equals, and you can just use your calculator. 218 times 64, divide that number by 166, and I get 84.05. And then since we're solving for A, we need to square root that, right? So A, and then just on your calculator, you can just square root it, and I get 9.17. So this right here is going to be 9.17 centimeters. Okay, so again, all I did was label this A and B. The scale factor is A to 8. To find the scale factor of the, the areas, you're going to do A squared to B squared, which is equal to 218 to 166, and then solve it for the A, because that's what we labeled as our AB, and that's centimeters. Let me just rename this, since it's asking for AB. So AB is 9.17 centimeters. Okay, so that's it for this lesson. Thank you for watching educator.com.